Hi everyone, this is Kim, and I'm making my first vlog post, vlog post for the spring semester. Last semester we had the privilege of reading a book entitled Five Minds for the Future by Howard Gardner. You probably remember him from certain books like Chasing Minds, it's very popular. Um, in this book, ha Gardner talks about um, five different minds that he feels would be crucial to possess in the future in order for us to thrive as a society. These minds include the disciplined mind, the synthesizing mind, the creating mind, the respectful mind, and the ethical mind. When he talks about the disciplined mind, he talks about us, um, I guess, in formal education, gaining a certain trait or getting a skill, such as accounting, finance, management, um, things in that, things of that sort. Obviously, outside, there's other things outside of business, but I'm a business major, so that's the first thing that comes to mind. But yeah, just learning a trait. The synthesizing mind, I feel, overlaps a little with the um, discipline mind in that in order to um, make other people understand something, you first understand it yourself and you're able to take certain information and amend it in a way um, to make to help other people understand. So it's basically like sharing knowledge that you have with other people. So creating mind talks about going above and beyond existing knowledge being creative and thinking outside the box and that's currently something I'm working on because I seem to be more pragmatic when it comes to um, certain situations. Um, the respectful mind is the fourth mind talking about seeking to understand other people, um, sympathizing with them, understanding where they're coming from, their point of view and that's going to be very crucial because the world is becoming global so I completely agree with that. The fifth, the ethical mind he talks about striving towards good work and good citizenship and obviously I think that's necessary because in order for us to thrive as a society we need to maintain some some sort of sanity you know like the law system that we have right now so um yeah so currently I'm working towards the discipline mind because I can say I don't have that yet but as a student at American University I'm looking to become a wonk in management and finance so that's something. I'm also looking to develop the synthesizing mind because I tend to just take information and regurgitate it instead of actually amending it or um, shaking it up in a way that um, really shows that I understand it. Even though I know I understand it, to help other people understand it, I think that would be very beneficial. And I'm also working on the creative mind, like I said before. But the respectful and the ethical mind, I am pretty confident that I have those down. So this book was very helpful in helping me understand what skills, what traits I will need to develop for future success.